Christoph Manuhutu and I'm part of RG cohort 2018 and I'm currently in a ministry called Bahtraku. When I heard RG from a friend, I thought that was such a great opportunity and I knew then that it was just for Jakarta cohort. So my friend who sent me this info, she said that just apply and I am the oddball. Basically that I don't live in Jakarta but was incorporated into the cohort through an online uh, program basically at that time. So faith and work, uh, my understanding before uh, joining RG was kind of like a, a separation, a secular and sacred divide basically but what uh, really helps me to understand that through joining RG that there is no separation in that because I before I came to the ministry I used to work in Ernst & Young which is a corporate company and everything is a corporate way in so many different ways and in the ministry it's almost like a totally different culture but understanding that both is actually ministry and how that uh, RG experience really helps me understanding that both really serve their purpose in their time. Faith is uh, the fundamental thing that really becomes the foundation of everything that is uh, happening in my life. So all the other uh, pillars is basically built on top of that foundation. So without faith, I'm gonna either have something else as a foundation and it's going to crumble really soon when the storm hits. I truly believe that uh, the Word of God has the power to transform people's lives. And my desire is to see people's lives being changed by the Word of God. And that's just, uh, we say faith comes by hearing, hearing the Word of God. And we want to see that Word of God being proclaimed so that people can hear and hear it clearly throughout the nations. And especially in the cities, in the context of now, it's urban and the way the young people speak is totally different compared to the elderly and it's just that adaptation but the same message is true that the message of Christ is going to be a transformation for all. Batraku is an uh, organization that I helped found it and the way it was it's one I helped founded it but in the following uh, months or years after, it really helped shape my uh, myself <clears throat> because in that uh, period I really learned that people are desperate to uh, hear the Word of God. People are slamming the table even to ask for the Word of God in their language and we have seen that request, that cry was not heard or was just being ignored basically and I couldn't just stay silent in the midst of that and that's why I really uh, take the initiative to mobilize all believers in Indonesia to be a part of that. I do have a lot of aspiration on that but one thing that I have learned from the past couple of years especially during COVID is that we don't really know anything about tomorrow and I really like that song I don't know about tomorrow you know and what is true in that song is our anchor is in Christ and no matter what tomorrow will bring we will uh, go through that anchored in that but if the dream is to see all tribes in Indonesia all people get to know and hear Christ clearly and that way they can come to the Lord. So I think the other thing that has been made clear to me in the past years was 
the reason Christ is not here yet is because uh, the gospel of the kingdom has not been preached to all nations. So that's something that I have the dream for Indonesia. I think one of the clear uh, remembrance of my cohort experience was the fellowship. Uh, to this day, uh, I, when I meet my fellow cohorts, I was like just meeting an old friend. Even though we have not been talking for a while, but it's like we can resume a conversation right away, right then, and talking about how the Lord has been moving or working in our lives. That's the first thing that I have witnessed. The other thing is, I just realized that my fellow cohorts now become speakers in RG. So I, I was like, great. I think that's going to be really impactful for the, the other people. I think uh, by joining RG, you will have uh, long-time friends and long-time mentors in the process. And that has been true for me. And that really has also shaped the way I am at the moment. And I believe for the years to come as well. So don't be hesitate to join RG. Thank you.